So we're standing on the roof of one of the world's most eco-friendly and energy efficient waste to energy plants. The idea for this project came back in 2010, where the power plant owners needed to build a new power plant. They thought that instead of building an ugly, grey, huge box, they wanted to give something back to the, to the city. And the concept was kind of simple and brilliant at the same time. So you take all the machinery and stack it on top of each other, you get a slope that goes down and bang, you get a ski slope on top of a power plant. One thing we immediately started to do was to add more functionalities. Apart from only a ski slope, which is nice, it's the biggest ski slope in Denmark. We don't have any mountains. We added the idea of the green landscape, the climbing wall, the ski center, which is also a cafe. Our main focus has been uh, creating a new nature on the roof uh, alongside the activities with the skiing and the climbing. So our part was mainly doing the very green rooftop park. I was asked to do the lighting for this uh, ski hill. I chose to put the lighting up on uh, this pipe for the lighting to come with an extreme narrow angle down from the back of the skier. The reason for this is that this would give the opportunity for the skier to look across the ocean, look in the city without getting blinded. When you go down in the children's part, it's the lighting coming from the top so that they can see themselves and they can see what they're doing. So it's two different solutions. Both of them, you almost don't see the lighting. You don't see the lamp, you only see the solution. So this is beautiful, and due to strong technical uh, solution, optical system from Iguzini, we were able to do this. When we started up uh, planting the roof, uh, we have used around 60 plant species. Now, a year or two after, this uh, the double. There's 60 new plant species. The plants are growing wild. We can see insects coming in, so there's habitats and new ecosystem growing out of this rooftop park uh, created uh, of nothing. So there's also a nature project in this where we try to make the vegetation and the lighting integrated. So this atmosphere is beautiful and we try to integrate the lighting in the vegetation to create shadows and give the vegetation a new dimension during the dusk hours but certainly also during the evening. People not only come here for the skiing and for the exercise, they also come to enjoy the view, to enjoy the evening. Even though it is an industrial plant, it has now become part of the Copenhagen uh, outdoor life, which is super. It's a whole new uh, way of approaching how to add value to those kind of uh, buildings. After a few meters of hiking up, you're forgetting that you're on top of a power plant. It's like you're in nature more or less. And then you come up here and whoa, and you have the smokestack and you can hear the sound of the machinery. And it's, it's kind of the combination of the industrial and the natural. People are, are really liking it and it's a huge attraction. Mm -hmm.